Hi, my name is Plano Rusev. I'm chairperson of E Academy, organizer of Webit, the biggest event for Central and Eastern Europe on uh, digital marketing and e business. Uh, we have fantastic speakers, but at the same time, we have fantastic visitors. Here is uh, one of my friends from Turkey, uh, very famous and uh, well known blogger there. And I would like to present you, Vladi Efe. Hi, Vladi, Hi. welcome to Webit. Thank so, you. Quite a lot of people from Turkey I see around. Uh, tell me, how was the wave it for you? Uh, first of all, I would like to congratulate you for this beautiful event. Uh, the first day was uh, very good, and now uh, we are also continuing with the second day. Uh, very exciting speakers, uh, very nice topics, and also a very good expo section. And I was uh, interested in the uh, Eastern Europe internet uh, companies mm -hmm. uh, so I could also get some information about Bulgarian and Romanian companies that was also very good for me and plenty of things to write about it. Great sounds good because this was actually the issue about Webby to yeah. to concentrate the whole region in one place so you can make the networking which is yeah. crucial for the business. Tell us who you are and um, okay present yourself please. I'm Vadi Efe uh, actually I have three topics to work about. I'm from Turkey and uh, I write about Turkish internet. Uh, I blog and write in magazines. Also, I have uh, my own uh, startups and uh, at the moment I am working for a company as the digital media director. So uh, I'm very busy nowadays. Yeah, you write for Digital Age in Turkey and yeah. for other big media? Yeah, uh, for example, uh, about Vivid, I, I will write in Marketing Turkey. Uh, this is one of the uh, biggest business magazines as a guest author. And I will also uh, report in WebRazi. It's uh, the most uh, popular Web 2.0 blog in Turkey. Thank you. Thank you for this. So, uh, tell us more about the Turkish market. Okay. Well, uh, let's start with the demographics. Okay. Uh, I will give you some recent information about the demographics in Turkey. Uh, Turks love internet. Uh, Turkey is a huge country with more than 70 million uh, people living in it. And there is more than 40% penetration. So that makes more than 25 million people use internet in Turkey. Uh, according to Comscore, uh, there is an official population of 70, uh, 17 million people using internet from a home with uh, broadband. Mm -hmm. uh, but there is an estimation of more than 25 million using with uh, internet Roma. cafes and uh, from the school, from the companies. Mm -hmm. So there is a huge population. It and is. there is still plenty of rooms to improve. Think about it. Like in Holland, there is a uh, more than 90% internet penetration. If it will, if it will be in Turkey, that would make more than 60 million people, and it's Everybody a will live there, very yeah. good population, uh, especially in the. This Eastern shows the Europe. potential of the of the. Yeah. So what is what is the demographics data in terms of, of age groups? What is the most active yeah. group there in Turkey? Uh, it's also very interesting because Turkey has a very young population, and uh, more than. 45% of the internet population is between 16 and 24 years old. Uh, it's a very young population. And so there are uh, a lot of projects uh, targeting the young people. And uh, also another very interesting information is Turkey has the uh, most, uh, how can I tell? Turkish people use uh, in average 32 hours internet in a month. Uh, that is the uh, that it's makes quite a lot. Turkey one hour, one hour every day. Yeah, the, the first country in Europe. Uh, so it. Turks love That's internet true. and use it a lot. So uh, the internet ad spend for for Turkey is 131 million, according to Alex uh, Yap Euro, yeah, uh, Europe. Europe report, uh, which actually brings uh, it's about one percent of the total. Uh, from the 12 uh, for 19 countries that IAB is following yeah. uh, the total volume for ad spent uh, for the region for euro for the 19 countries is 12.9 billion so with 131 you're about one percent and yeah. a little bit more uh, what are the, what are your expectations for the market what what are the uh, the, the professionals there say as expectations for 2009 how hard was for the publisher this year was it was it as bad as all over the Europe um. First of all, Interactive Advertising Bureau was established in Turkey two years ago. And they are uh, starting to uh, organize the digital advertising scene in Turkey. At the moment, there are uh, works about a standard, standard, uh, standardization, standardization of the uh, publishers mm -hmm. and the traffic of Turkey. So that will make a clear uh, overall 
view of the Turkish market and projects. So uh, things will be much easier for the uh, advertisers to spend money in it. And also, since uh, two years, uh, since the middle of the of 20, uh, 2007, uh, foreign foreign companies are entering the Turkish market, and there are also a lot of uh, in, invest, investments, and also some companies are acquiring other uh, Turkish companies. So that shows us there the, uh, it's still improving, and there will be much more and better uh, projects. And also uh, foreign uh, brands and Turkish brands are spending more and more uh, money in Turkish internet. Uh, for example, yesterday I met uh, the digital leader of uh, Procter and Gamble Turkey and uh, she yeah, told she me is they were, guest, yeah, yeah she is also here as a guest and she told me they are starting to invest more and more in digital uh, projects and digital advertising okay those are good news about Turkey are you optimistic yeah I'm very optimistic because like I can tell you I was living in Germany for three years uh, and when I went to Germany uh, to work about internet uh, I was not that optimistic about the Turkish internet but when I was living there things things were going uh, things started to go very well, like these investments and uh, acquisitions. And there are, at the moment, a lot of uh, different events about Internet in Turkey. And uh, there are like aggregators, social networks, and people know each other, and people start to uh, work together and invest in Internet. And like, uh, if you read newspapers, if you read business magazines, there are like a lot of uh, different uh, news about Internet, and it's very hip nowadays and people are uh, very interested in the digital scene and internet. Thank you, Vladi Efe, uh, Turkey, one of the, the bloggers there who will, is here at Webits and sharing good optimistic facts about the Turkish market. I think that everybody here is sharing good optimistic facts about the, about the regional market, so hopefully this will be the good news from Webit. Thank you, my name is Paul Rusev, chairperson of E-Academy. Enjoy the rest of the video. Thanks.